Since 1974, Peach County High School students have reported to their campus off Highway 341, but that could soon change. With the groundbreaking in October, Kayla Solomon spent the morning at the current high school to learn more about the changes coming to the new one. What's really interesting in our counseling department, our counseling department has always had people that graduated from here since I've been here. All the counselors have graduated from Peach County High School. Chandra Thomas is the class of 1988. And she came back as a counselor here 12 years ago. So I think any community, when they have that growth of something new and something changed, it's exciting, but at the same time, you're a little reminiscent about what was before. Thomas says times have changed since her days as a student, and the 55-year-old building is in need of some upgrades. But there's eight different buildings our kids have to leave, they actually leave the building. Whereas the new high school is a pinwheel design, so they'll get there in the morning, they won't leave the building until they leave in the afternoon. Principal Ken Hartley is also a Peach County High School graduate, and he says safety is a top priority. But it's a little more difficult with eight buildings and over 60 entrances on campus. The designers back in 1974, you know, had, didn't deal with issues that we're dealing with now. Of course, all the school shootings, it seems like every time you turn around, you hear of a school shooting somewhere in the United States. The school will go from this current eight building design to this, with one central lobby and hallways branching off. This new school will cost about $30 million total, with $16.8 million coming from the 2015 East Blast. This includes the latest technology and science labs. Of course, the equipment is outdated, and you know, we got the best kids in the state of Georgia, and we want to give them the best resources we can for them to be successful. Hartley says they hope to be in the new school by fall of 2021. In Peach County, Kayla Solomon, 13 WMAZ News. School officials plan to save the main Peach County High School building and find a new use, and they hope to find buyers for the other seven buildings.